you're on. Hi, my name's Ellen Honey, and I am one of the judges that has done the Southern Region uh, virtual cat competition to uh, see what cats are going to end up in the international. And I must tell you that this was a challenge. It was great fun to judge. Thank you, Southern Region, for inviting me. My home away from home, should I say, and was my home for 22 years. Thank you to all of the sponsors for this and all the people behind the scenes that have worked so hard. So now we are going to look at my household pet finals. My 15th best household pet is this darling Dilute Calico. Look at that face and don't you just love that little cream stripe right where it just sits? This cat is two years old and she just kind of took my eye, which is what happens when we judge household pets. It's what we like, not we don't have a standard, it's just what we like. And she was one of my 15. So she's 15th best today. And my 14th best household pet is a brown tabby in white. Um, almost looks, with the coat almost looks a little harsh, um, more so than an American Shorter. I'm thinking maybe this is a straight wire hair. Beautiful head type on this cat. I mean, it's just the face is so pretty and the markings are outstanding. 14th best household pet today. This is a Torty and White, 15 years and six months old. Isn't she pretty? She looks like she rules the roost. She's absolutely darling. She's my 13th best household pet today. Well, they got me again, brown patch tabby and white. Tabby, brown patch tabbies, torties, they're just colorful and flashy. And look at the color on this baby. Uh, let's see, four years and four months of age. Absolutely darling, she's my 12th best household pet. And I'm a sucker for a lynx point. Um, I had them all my lives. One of my first kitties was a lynx point ever when I was just a young cat. So I, a young cat kitten, she just kind of took a look at her blue eyes. I think she's lovely. She is only nine months old, or I should say, I'm sorry. Um, he is all, only nine months old, but look at that face. Don't you think it's angelic and female? 11, uh, she is my 11th best household pet today. What a smoke. Wow. Smoke when you can see the pattern through. Um, I, I'm not sure if it's something that maybe is a mix with a, an Egyptian Mao, a smoke Mao, maybe, maybe not. But it is a black smoke. He's a male and he's seven years and six months old. And doesn't he look like, who, me? I would never do that. Today, he's my 10th best household pet. My ninth best household pet, I just think she, it's, this is a red and white van. What that means is she has color on her head and ears, her tail, and she might be allowed to have one or two spots on her body, but I don't think she does. She has a beautiful face. It's almost a Japanese bobtail face. I mean, she's got those high cheekbones and beautiful eyes. Today she is, she's a year and four months, and she's my ninth best household pet. Black and white tuxedo, we all have to have one. My goddaughter has three. And don't you think that is the cutest picture in the world? With those, those are the, some of the longest whiskers I've ever seen. This cat is six years old, female, and today my eighth best household pet. Oh, this is a black, silver, classic, and white medium hair, I would say. Um, it's a male and two years old. It just, it, there was just something about this cat that made me say, oh, aren't you precious and pretty green eyes too. Seventh best household pet today. Seal, torty, and white. What a pretty face. It almost looks like a Berman face. Um, this cat is 11 years and seven months old. I'm always impressed with the condition of our older cats and how well they're kept. It's a tribute to the person that, that owns this cat um, and treats it obviously like it's one of their children. Today, my sixth best household pet. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at the, the, the markings on this cat. I love the way 
particularly if you look at the back legs, it's like, oops, I put on different socks this morning. This is a tortie in white, only four months old, a baby, um, well, or a brown patch tabby in white, depending on how you want to look at it. I can see that's probably been a rescue kitty. You can see where one of these either, at four months old, I don't think this cat's been in a fight, but you can see a lot of times they will uh, take the tip off of one ear so that they can recognize them after they trap, neuter, and, and release. And in this case, obviously this cat was adopted by somebody and they're having the best time. Anyway, she is my fifth best household pet today. Seal point in white. What a beautiful cat. There's another one that's almost what I used to call a snowshoe. Beautiful blue eyes. I love the markings and I'm a sucker for the pattern. Fourth best household pet. Now isn't that a cutie? What a darling little cat. It's a red tabby in white. Um, red classic tabby in white male and it's only five months old. So he's got a lot of growing to do but he just caught my eye and I thought he was sitting just like a, being a good boy and waiting for somebody to give him a treat. Third best household pet today. What a darling picture. This is a brown patch tabby in white. She is eight years old. And don't you think she's like a happy camper? Look at the way she's just laying there looking up at us. Please rub my belly. Second best household pet today. And my best household pet. Oh my God, look at this face. What a face. It's a calico, eight years and eight months old. And I mean, looks like there's lots of curly hairs on this cat. Just adorable. That's another one whose cheeks you want to pinch. And I was very taken with the color. So today, my best household pet.